Hi everybody, welcome back to my 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed 2. On this video we are going to be completing the mission, main mission, Everything Must Go. And that's going to bring us to an end to sequence 7. And it starts off um, by talking to Antonio in his den over here. But we're nowhere near that at the moment, so we've got to get there first. And while we do that we're going to reduce our notoriety because it seems to be quite high. That was an interesting jump. This is the quickest and easiest way of getting there. You can run through the streets. But it's better just to swim past the um, setter, as it's called. And then we'll make our way there through that. Oh, some guards. Quite a way. But there's a start the attempt. Recent flooding in the Lido facing Sestieri of the Chita has caused some structural damage. Please be careful near work site. Report any unattended damage to city property and be courteous. Okay, there we go. Who taught you to move? What a great run that was. This is a nice bit of free running. Love it. Oh! Messed that bit up though. All who need aid are welcome here. Okie dokie, here we are at the door and we're going to go and talk to Antonio. Everything must go. Work with Antonio and he sees to defeat Emilio. Please enter. Your good work has restored us to our former strength, Ezio. We are ready to strike. Just tell me what needs to be done, and I'll see that it is. You'll approach from above under the cover of night. Emilio has posted archers around the palazzo. Kill them, but do so quietly. As they fall, my men shall replace them. What about the guards? When you finish with the archers, we'll regroup in front of this building here, and discuss next steps. Nessun problema. I'll take care of the archers and return to you. Then it's settled. In Bocca al Lupo. Crepi Lupo. So we've got to kill these five archers to start with, and we're going to aim for that one first. <laughs> so we might as well run around this way for now. Be 
bit more of that free running that I like so much. <laughs> bit more of that failing of the free running that I like so much. Never mind. Climb up there, will ya? Doesn't seem to want to climb that bit. Not far away now. Any citizen of Venezia have been revived. These have been posted as amendments to the laws concerning the Coliganza, available for consultation in all Uffici Comunali. Here we go, we're coming to our first one. But won't get away! So although it's better if we could do it um, stealthily, it doesn't look like it's necessary. No, oh, we'll let him... We'll try to do these ones still free, shall we? At least try. This is number three. Ah, oh, but he's seen me as well. Oh, I think I'm not. And one left. And he's over there. And that's that one dealt with as well. So now we have to go meet Antonio. And Antonio is down here somewhere. Everything is going according to plan. As we speak, my men are replacing the archers you've removed. The way to the palazzo is clear now. But not the building itself. Emilio's guards still patrol its border. Use my men. They can distract the guards. Save you from having to fight. And when it comes time to storm the place, remember what I've taught you. Seek out, Oizio. We await word of your success. So, here we go, we're now going to go, it's time to go and get rid of Emilio. We are with you. Right. your magic. So we send the thieves in, the thieves will get those guards to chase them. And that's what we had to learn this for because we can't do this any other way than climbing with that leap there. 
Okay. So now we want to get rid of these guards that are up here. Your little house of cards is crumbling, Emil. A minor setback. It will be dealt with. This povero Shemo Antonio and his thieves. Never mind them. It's the assassin you should be worried about. Why? Is... is he in Venezia? He's been here for weeks. How could you be so blind? Unlike you, I've been busy. Someone had to provide the weapons to our brothers in Firenze. Yes. And we all saw what did that. Enough with the party. What is it you want, Carlo? Maestro has called me. Three days from now, it's on to Very well. I'll be there. Assuming you still live. If you want my advice, I'd find a less conspicuous place to go. a target now. Seta is a fortress. If you say it. Goodbye, Emilio. Cazzo. What if he's right? You, call for my boat. It should be close. When it arrives, load we those and prepare to sail. I'll be right back. If Carlos takes through, I must find a place to hide, just until the meeting. Then, the attack. I must be working with Antonio. That means the attack. No, I've worked too hard for this. I feel no fear, assassin. Only regret. I sought unity. Stability. Order. At too great a cost. Progress demands sacrifice. Non trova alcuna gioia in questo. Ma non c'è altro modo. Requiescat in pace. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. Come, let's open the gate for Antonio. Set has fallen and Emilio is no more. All thanks to you, Ezio. Go, tear down Emilio's banners. Return what he has stolen from the people. Tell me, Ezio. How can I repay you for your service? Money's always nice. Easy enough. What else? Emilio is meeting with a man named Carlo. He looked to be a government official. Do you know him? Carlo Grimaldi. He sits on the Council of Ten. Why do you ask? What are you up to? I have a meeting to attend. And there we have it. Everything must go is synced. <coughs> and that is the end of sequence seven. So our friend the white screen comes back and then it will rebuild sequence 8 in front of our very eyes. And we find ourselves on the top of the viewpoint where 
we first um, came into Venezia, or Venice as we call it, I suppose. So there we are, that was there. Um, we can see that there is now an assassin's tomb on the on the screen. Uh, that's where our next mission starts. We've got this codex page over here. And of course we have that viewpoint there to go to. But that's where we're going to call it a day for on this video. So thank you very much for watching. And as Ezio has already said, requiescat in pace.